I, I live in Napier, um, but the reason that I've become involved in this cause and, and really strongly believe in it is that I've had the unique um, situation of being in both a local authority, <coughs> Napier City Council, but in also two regional authorities, the Hawke's Bay Regional Council and the Hawke's Bay District Health Board. And that's given me, I think, a, a, a regional view of things and I know that regional representation and regional governance work because I've been part of it. It's as simple as that. People, 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 people. It, it, if we could double the population by next Monday, we'd start really moving. <clears throat> people create jobs, people create opportunities, they create demand, and that's what we don't have. And we're growing so slowly. We're right at the bottom of the league tables. Add on top of that all the other social and educational factors that are also at the bottom of the league tables. So all those things need to lift, but I think the key is attracting people. Um, people love the climate, they love our restaurants and all the other things that we think are great, but it needs more than that to attract people. I've got five daughters, all of whom were educated in Napier, they love coming here, they'd love to come back here with their families and work, there are no opportunities. It's the key. And without that, without that unified approach and without some strong leadership we are going to just continue for another 20 or 30 or 50 years pretty much as we are. Nice place to live but wallowing at the bottom. I know that there are people out there and, and, and I don't mean our present civic leaders many of whom have painted themselves into a corner regretfully and there's no way that they would be acceptable in an amalgamated body because they've just spoken so vigorously against it. But there are other young people. I know when I was asked to join the council, and I'm not holding myself up as an example of a leader, but the thought had never been further from my mind until someone came and asked me, a man I had huge respect for, a previous Deputy Mayor of Napier. Now there are people like that around who don't even think of themselves as leaders, have no particular interest in civic life, but if they're approached, they're identified, they're there. I'm absolutely convinced of it.